today is our RDL. Our RDL is one of the main lifts we use in our program just because of all the Olympic lifts we do. So if you really can't do an RDL, you're not going to be able to do uh, any of our Olympic lifts. In our RDL, we have three steps we do to concentrate on, just as I stated before. Stand tall, knees bent forward, and push my butt straight back. When, we, when our athletes come in here, these are the three things we communicate with them. Okay, now we're going to have one of our athletes come in, and I'm going to teach him an RDL. So, first thing I'm going to say to Tommy, Tommy, stand tall. Okay, time to stand nice and tall. Now get your knees bent slightly forward. Okay, just from here, Tommy, all he's going to do is push his butt straight back and his weight's going to go on his heels. Good, Tommy. Do one more, please. Good. Three things we don't want to see. We don't want to see Tommy's shoulders come forward when he does his RDL. That's a no-no. We need to get our chest up and our shoulders back. Next thing, we don't want to push our knees too far forward. Like that. That's not going to work any of our hamstring. And the last thing is squatting with the bar. So when he's coming down, he's just going to squat like that. Those are the three things we don't want to see and then we usually do see. Okay, so a good RDL, we have our stand tall, knees slightly bent, and push our butt straight back. Good time. Alright, that's how we RDL here at Fast. It's one of the main things we do to teach our Olympic lifts.